today's project is going to be the stabilizer feet. Last week we did the crowd arm. Like I said, the blue stuff is what's completed. The red is what's going to be uh, the project for this week. So stabilizer feet and the arms together, nine and ten. We got to do two of them, one on each side. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get all that cut, um, get it all ready to go so we can get it welded. Now we do have a little side project because last week when we did some of these brackets for the crowd arm, they uh, warped a little bit and we were trying to bend them back out. We mentioned it, I don't think we showed it on, on video what we were trying to do, um, but our table that we have, that green table with the white top, it's just a uh, wood top. Um, so we took a vise and it screwed into the actual table. When we were trying to bend those quarter inch plates out, we had to actually put the uh, loader on top of the table, put the bucket there so the table wouldn't move. Well, we got, you know, we got some of it bent out and then the, the table broke. So we have found a flatbed off a of pickup that's been sitting out here for years. So what we are gonna do is repurpose this bed, build a new table out of uh, what we have. Let's get to work. stabilizer arms, the feet, um, all the bushings, everything's drilled out, ready to go, ready to be welded together. We're running out of time today. We still want to see if we can break that frame off of that uh, diamond plate. So we're going to give that a try. We're going to put this on hold for today. We'll be back at it tomorrow to finish this up. And we're back. Day two of the stabilizer arm build. We had everything cut that you see on the table. Uh, everything was drilled, all the bushings. Everything is ready to go. So all I have to do is tack weld that and then finish weld it after we make sure everything fits just right. Um, so I'm gonna do that. We're gonna do a little time lapse of that. Jason's gonna continue working on the uh, table, our little repurposed table, because he broke it last time. 
<laughs> um, so he's going to finish cutting off some of this diamond plate so we can use the rails as support. Um, and then we have to grind the, the, the flat top that we have. We're going to jump into that, get to work, and we'll see you when it's done. is going to be uh, the bucket. Um, once that's done, it'll be mounting to the tractor and then we can test it and make sure it works before we paint it. So, catch you next time. <laughs>